that's a, a, a celebration today, 60 years of an amazing Ghanaian, a, a terribly important Ghanaian, an instrumental Ghanaian, a true Ghanaian who went abroad, came back, and came to serve Ghana with his skills. Talk of went abroad reminds me of the scholarship story that I'll be doing later on, but forget about that for now. This is a celebration of a Ghanaian. Incidentally, as we celebrate him, he also celebrates his son, whose birthday is today. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it is my utmost pleasure to introduce a montage celebrating the big birthday, a very, very, very happy birthday to you, the indefatigable Minister for Education, Osei Aweduchum. This is for you. Happy birthday to Osei Aweduchu, man. I was particularly moved by what uh, the Honorable Minister wrote on social media. He says, double birthday celebration. Today marks a special day as my son, Nanayao Jr., and I celebrate our birthdays. Both of them, incidentally, were born on Thursday. Nanayao and Oseyao. Uh, um, happy birthday to us both, he says. As Minister for Education, I am fortunate to witness the transformative power of education every day. On this occasion, I'm reminded of the importance of nurturing young minds and empowering them to reach their full potential. Reaching age 60 is a testament to the blessings of life, the wisdom gained, the opportunities to serve. I am grateful for the support of my family, colleagues, and the Ghanaian community. To my dear son, Anayal, may your birthday be filled with joy, laughter, and endless blessing. You bring light and happiness to our lives, and I'm incredibly proud of the son of the person you are becoming. Here is to embracing this new decade with gratitude. Oh, a new decade? Why is it 20? Okay. Uh, embracing this new decade with gratitude, resilience, and commitment to making a positive impact in education and beyond. That's a fantastic message from Osei Aweduchum, from all of us uh, here at Good Evening Ghana, Metro TV, and uh, I believe I can speak for entire media fraternity. Osaya Educhum has been such an important punctuation in the politics of the Akufado government since 2017. His first foray on the Joy FM's news file as Deputy Minister of Education gave a lot of hope and confidence to the millions of people who were listening to that news file program that the guy speaking on the radio, it's a great educationist. Nobody had heard of him at the time. He was in Parliament, people knew him. But when he spoke on Joy FM's news file for the first time, I had the interview, I called the people that I wanted to interview him. When he came here on Good Evening Ghana, those days when Laboni Educhum was completely fantastic. We forged a friendship and a relationship with him. As you can see, he invited us here to his office to show us. He's, he's a, bit, a bit like Dr. Baumia. He's very data-driven. He's very Americanized in his orientation, and he's a completely great man. What Edutum has done, which you cannot take away from him, is that he has clearly introduced into the Ghanaian education, uh, Ligua Franca, if you like, STEM, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Edutum is the STEM minister. Everybody calls him that. He has firmly ingrained STEM 
the development of STEM in secondary education in our lives. It's going to turn us around, make us better than Japan and China in the future. That will be Dr. Iduchum's dream. Iduchum will hope that by the time he's 90 and 95, Ghana will be a very powerful STEM country. We can all promise him that because if that happens, it will benefit anyone, everyone uh, in the country. Osei Iduchum has also been mentioned as one of the potential running mates for Alhaji Muhammad Dubaumia. An announcement that is due soon. Will it be Osei Iduchum? I don't know. But the announcement is due very, very soon in this month. Dr. Baumia will name his running mate. Whoever, whether Iduchum gets it or not, Iduchum has definitely paid his dues into this Akufuado government, particularly at the Ministry of Education. From deputy minister to minister, Osei Iduchum has stood tall and showed Ghanaians that he is passionate about STEM. And this is a minister who has a portfolio that can be marked. You can mark Iduchum every month and he will tell you what he has done. You can mark him every two weeks and he will tell you what he has done. If the kind of seriousness that he attaches to his work in terms of his understanding of education is the same that we have had from many ministers in this fourth republic, Ghana would have been like Japan by now. I can say more, but tonight we will leave it here and allow him to celebrate in peace. Let's play the montage again. Osaya Oduchum, from the very depths of our hearts, we wish you a great birthday and we wish your son uh, to be great. The Bible says that the glory of the latter days shall be more than the former. So whatever you have achieved, may your son achieve double of it. Osayo Oduchum, happy birthday. Here's the montage again.